Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Lewis Pike here. Um, today I'm going to do a video that's a little bit different from what I've done. Um, I'm going to do a unboxing of this new iMac Pro that I just bought uh, for my office. I'm going to be trying to do a lot more videos of me behind the scenes. Um, so part of that is I'm remodeling my office and I use a lot of cool gear and stuff to shoot these videos and also use some gear for um, work every day. So I figured I might as well do a unboxing video to kind of show you guys some of the things that I'm doing uh, behind the scenes. So let's jump into it. All right, so I am going to start unboxing this 2018 iMac Pro. Previously, I had a um, older iMac that I was using. Um, it was slowing down, so slowing me down from being more efficient from work. And then I switched over to a 2015 MacBook Pro that I had um, that was working okay, but I feel like I am just putting too much strain on it. Um, during the day, and I don't think it's gonna be my everyday use machine, so I need to get a machine that is going to work. So I'm really excited about this machine here because I think this is gonna be the one. So let's get into the unboxing here. So as you can see, it is a very big box. I actually had to get the um, guys from Apple to help me uh, carry this guy out, which is unusual. All right, so this is the box here. So this is the machine here. The iMac Pro, they just came out with um, late in 2017, actually in December of 2017. Um, so I've been waiting a few months to get it. Uh, wanted to save up so I could just pay for it um, cash. Didn't have to, didn't want to do any finance or anything on it. So I've been saving for a few months and kind of just worked out because it's time for, it was time for me to buy a new machine. So as you guys can see here, it uh, is a little bit different if you've ever purchased an iMac before. Um, they actually got like the matte finish like covering on it. Um, as well typically in the past this is usually white so let's start here i'm just gonna pull this guy out here see what we have in here oh, if i can get the box open yeah you can tell it's been a while since i've done um one of these or bought a new computer for the mac well this is starting out great awesome just slide it out so this is cool. So there is a black power cord here. Usually they have, they come in white. My previous ones were white. So that's pretty cool. Kind of matches the theme of the uh, computer. Let's see if there's anything else in here that we have. Oh yeah, right up here. So up here as well, let's pull this out. I'm guessing this is probably the uh, keyboard here. So let's pull that out. I'm going to put these items over here to the side go off camera a little bit. All right, so let's open up the keyboard case here. Let's see what's the best way to open this. I like to be careful with the boxes because I like to uh, reuse stuff. So sometimes I don't really like to just tear and go. So let's open this guy up. All right, so sliding it out. Ooh, that's nice. So this looks like, uh, this is the keyboard as I mentioned. Look at that, that's pretty cool, right? It's a, um, it has the matte finish as well um, on the keyboard to match the computer. So this is nice. It's been a while since I've had a actual um, full out keyboard. Right now I'm using a black and silver keyboard. It's a Logitech keyboard, which I actually like, but it's a lot smaller than this. So it's to be cool and interesting to see if I use it. Pretty cool, has a back, um, sorry, a black back. The ones in the past had the um, white back, so. This is cool. I'm gonna set this over here as well. All right, so jumping back in, let's see what else we have in here. So I'm assuming this is the mouse, which is cool. So look at that, that's black, that's pretty nice. It's a glossy black on the front and then it has the matte finish on the back, uh, which is really nice. And then it has, one thing that I wish they'd upgrade on this, I've heard this on the new, on the Magic Mouses is, you can charge them, but the charge is on the bottom. Not really convenient. I'm using a Logitech MX2 mouse right now, and it's easy for me to charge and use it when the battery goes dead. So maybe they'll upgrade that on the next version. But nonetheless, we'll see if I use it. Not really a big fan of these mice, at least in the past. So I may give it a try, but most likely gonna use uh, what I'm currently using. So let's drop this over here as well. All right, let's see what else we have in here. All right, so this is cool here. A uh, power cord. So 
it is a Apple certified power cord, which is black because this is cool. They don't sell these. So it'd be nice to have one of these. I have a black one, but it is not Apple certified. So I'm going to replace it with this guy. Nice. I assume this is for the mouse to charge it. All right, let's see if there's anything else that we have in here. Nothing there. So I can move that to the side. Looks like there's something in here. Let's see what we got. So we've got, it's like it's just a quick true guide instruction manual. Oh, look what we found here. This is gonna be pretty cool. Uh, just paper stuff I'm not gonna read. Boom, black Apple stickers. That's cool, really excited about these. I've only gotten white, so yeah, this is awesome. I guess they're keeping everything black with the theme, which is cool. So just throw this over here. And then one other thing here, oh, a cleaning cloth, which is, you guessed it, a black cleaning cloth to go with the computer. So that's cool, some pretty cool accessories that are in here. So let's go over here, that over here as well. I don't know if I mentioned so, I got the standard configuration, so the very, the base model. Um, I didn't, it's the eight core model, uh, 32 gigs of RAM, 100 ter, sorry, one terabyte uh, solid state drive. I think that's all that I really need. Um, I could have upgraded and got a more expensive one, but um, this is gonna be perfect for what I'm, what I'm doing. I'm not doing anything really heavy, although I do some um, video editing and podcast editing stuff, um, and some graphic design that I think this one will be just fine. Uh, but I'll give you guys an update. This is just the unboxing. Um, and about a week or two after I've used it, I'll do another video just giving everyone an update on how this model is doing. Hopefully I won't regret it. So let's get to the um, actual computer here. So I am going to, one second, I'm gonna move the big box really quick out of the way. Move this to the side. Oh, well, make it as easy as I thought. All right, so move this. Definitely gonna keep this guy. Uh, I need to store this thing and move this thing around. Be good to have this big box that goes along with it. So, thank you, Apple. But for now, I don't need it. So, I'm gonna put that to the side. All right, so. Let's throw this guy back up here. Oh, perfect. So uh, a little bit more room here. Okay, so let me take this off, this cover. All right, there we go. So that guy is off there. So this is the machine. Nice, it's a nice big 27 inch screen, uh, 5K monitor that comes with it as well. Uh, so that's really nice. So I'm gonna take off this um, plastic here. I do have a uh, cleaning cloth, cloth that they gave me, so I guess fit any fingerprints on it, I'm just clean it up. But let's get that off. Awesome, one second. Uh -oh. There we go. All right, so that's cool. Has the sleek matte design. I really love this color. Um, I know in the past I've only had the silver, so this is nice. It's pretty sleek, it's clean, modern looking, pretty dope. So that's the front, and then this is the back here. Um, looks like they have a black Apple icon on the back, and there's just some plastic over it, over that as well. So I'll take that off as well. And that is it. And this is just all the ports and stuff that's on here. Several USB ports. Um, looks like it has um, several lightning ports. So USB-C, I'm not sure what the exact type of port that is, but I'll figure it out. And headphone jack. And then we have a, looks like a memory card slot here. It's cool for getting footage on and off. Um, and then it has a um, ethernet port back here, which is cool, it's arc on hardwired. Um, Got a pretty good internet pipe, uh, a gig up, a gig down. So um, I like to be hardwired if possible. So that'd be great. But I mean, that is pretty much it. Um, on the um, 2018 iMac Pro, 
I'm really excited to crack this guy open and get it fired up. This will actually be the first video that I uh, am going to edit on it. So it's kind of ironic, but it's cool. So I will, um, I'll check back in with you guys in about a week or two. Um, let you guys do another video just updating on how it's performing, how I like it, um, how it's working compared to my previous models. Um, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be a lot better than the previous models I have. But anyway, if you guys like this video and want me to do more of these type of videos, uh, just drop a comment down below. I'll continue to try to do uh, videos as I get equipment and get stuff um, to help with my business. Um, I will be letting you guys know kind of more of me behind the scenes. Like I said, this is one of my first unboxing videos, so I'll do a lot more if you guys are interested in it. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Um, if you um, are not following me, make sure that you subscribe. Um, if you subscribe, make sure you click the little bell. That way you get notified whenever I drop um, videos. So have a good day. It's Lewis Pike, checking out. Peace.